everyone, welcome or welcome back to Budgets and Dreams. My name's Jen and I'm on a journey to pay off an absolute boatload of debt. <laughs> um, I hope you are to giggle after that. If you're new here, I'm not laughing at the fact I have debt. I'm just laughing at the fact that I say that every week. <laughs> um, I hope you've had an amazing week. Um, it's really rainy right now. This is on Thursday. Maybe Friday is better weather uh, for you guys. But uh, today, Thursday, very rainy and very cloudy and a bit meh. But never mind. Um, right. I don't know where to begin. <laughs> <laughs> have a look at last week's affirmation. Um, so last week's affirmation was, it's okay to take a break and re-energise when needed. So true. So into our new pack of affirmations from Mummy Doodles. This week's affirmation is... Oh, <laughs> I might cry. I am enough and don't need to prove anything to anyone. Yes. <laughs> absolutely blinking yes definitely I am enough and don't need to prove anything to anyone I love that I cannot even express how much I am in love with that affirmation love it love it love it uh right so change to normal proceedings again this week I'm not going to do any iPad stuff again just because I'm still not able to find my words particularly well um so I'm just going to jump straight into the cash um a couple of things that have happened digitally um my husband got paid an extra week's worth of wages this week that's because he gets paid every four weeks and then every number of years or something that means he gets an extra week's pay we have no idea how it works but we got an extra week so that's great um so 250 of that has gone straight into um debt whoop uh ben's taking an extra hundred for spending i'm taking an extra hundred for spending and then the remaining uh little bits we're just going to stuff into the binders so that is the plan for today but we have got a lot of cash to stuff and my yellow binder is back oh i love it so anyone who hasn't seen this before yes it's just a boring plain yellow binder but I cannot tell you how happy I am to have this back. <laughs> um, so this was my original binder. This is where it all started. This particular colour of yellow means a lot to me. So a few weeks ago, I talked about a breathing exercise. It came up as part of the affirmations, but it's one I've done before where you, I think that affirmation said you breathe in joy and exhale something, fear, I can't remember. But the one that I do is you breathe in hope and you exhale fear. And my colour for hope is this exact colour yellow. Um, so when I first bought this binder and it arrived and it was this colour, I was like, oh my gosh, that's just meant to be. Um, and yeah, when I restocked this um, the other day, I literally gave it a little hug. <laughs> so happy to have it back I'm so excited about this and um everything in here is all new and different but you will see as we go along so let's count the cash oh and I've got some things here to tell you about but I will do that at the right time so we have got a wedge o cash so 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 93 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. So 360, 365, 368, 369. We are stuffing 369 pounds, which is so much money. Um, nearly 100 pounds of that is going straight back to repay the credit card though. <laughs> so boo. So as I've mentioned it, let's do that first. So credit card pouch for next month we are putting 96 pounds in here so 20 40 60 80 90 uh got a grubby one yep yeah, 95 96 i could have got grubby 20 pound notes as well couldn't i actually thinking about it hang on let me just swap these out right so well, i could use those grubby tenors oh shall i actually yeah hang on <laughs> Right, we'll put those two back and we'll get some really nasty. One, two, three, four, there we go. Right, that should add up to 96 pounds. Let's have a look. So 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 95, 96, perfect. And also I was today years old when I realized that 10 pound notes have a little pound symbol there. That's a really scuddy one, you probably can't see it. It's a little pound symbol, had no idea that was there. 
until today. Right, so £96 is going into the credit card pouch ready for when next month's bill comes in. So that will come in in a couple of weeks, um, but we won't have to pay it until the beginning of May. So £96 in there. That was £34 for me, just for random bits of rubbish spending, which I will now be doing direct from my own personal bank account. Uh, £50 from budgeted spends. £40 of that was for a retirement present for my dad. How exciting. I messaged him one day, just got this feeling I needed to message my dad. And I messaged him and he said, oh yeah, I'll retire tomorrow. I was like, well, you could have told me sooner. <laughs> so I just, on the credit card, just a quick bottle of whiskey. Um, I got him in the end. Um, and then uh, a bit extra for groceries as well. And then £12 from Family Fun, which was just a bit of hangover um, spendage from when we went to the cinema ages ago. Um, but it fell into the next statement period. So it just took ages to come out. Anyway, £96 in the credit card envelope, which is great. So let's get stuck in. Um, I might be a bit all over the place because I have juggled things around a bit. So bear with. Right then. So let's start with, oh, which binder? Let's start with this one. So we're going to start with the family binder, which is otherwise known as my spring binder. So budgeted spends, first of all, then is getting 50 quid. Oh, there's some change in there. Super. So those four can stay for um, cheeky bonus, 10 into floss. And we're putting 50 quid into budgeted spends like that. Um, family Fund's not getting anything, but that's because we just put that onto the credit card. So there's just £10 in there. Time for us is getting £5 uh, like that. So we've got 20, 30, 40, 5. And then two new ones, Fuel and Huel. Um, I nearly called this petrol and then I realised that would be no fun. <laughs> so Fuel now has all of the money that was in the credit card envelope ready for the next credit card bill. We're going to put another 40 in there. So we now have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60. And we will unstuff um, Fuel when the next statement comes in and put it into the credit card pouch. Huel is getting £10, so that will now have 30 And then the dentist doesn't get anything, that money is still there. Do you know, I realise this should probably have been in the bank this whole time, earning me some money. Um, so, yeah, I might put that in the bank. Uh, I don't know, I kind of like having it there. It's the only thing that's got any money in it. <laughs> right, car. So we're going to do a bit of juggling in car because I realised um, there's actually only 185 left in the savings for car because we had to get those tyres. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take £15 back to the bank um, to top this back up to £200, which will leave us just £5 in for car alarma. Um, if I do that now, it's going to cause some cash stuffing problems. Ooh, what do I do? Um, no, let's do it now. So, yeah, so that's five. Yeah, and then I'll rub those three off. So there will just be one. And then the car alarm tracker is going somewhere else a little bit later on, which you will see. So once I put that £15 back in the bank, that will take this up to £200. And then that means I can introduce these. So I was having a bit of a play with vellum. Um, and seeing if I could make myself some little placeholders. So the placeholders I make are normally around the same size as a £20 note because I never stuff anything more than that. Um, so, and I like them. My hands are too small for 50s and bigger placeholders. So I've made these. So I've got a 50, a 100, a 200, a 500, a 1,000, 2,000 and 5,000. Um, I don't know if I'm going to sell these in the shop, to be honest. Um, I need to look at the cost effectiveness because they are printed on vellum, which is a bit more expensive. But if you like the look of these, let me know. And uh, if there is enough interest, then I might make a bunch and put them in the shop. Oh, speaking of the shop, um, I've had a sale running for the past couple of weeks, but I just kept forgetting to tell anyone. <laughs> um, so the sale ends on the 6th of April, I think, um, which I think is Saturday, uh, just FYI. Right, so what we're going to do then is we're going to take away those placeholders that we already did and then put the £15 in and then that takes car back up to £200. Oh, see, clever. So there's £200 in the car now, which is great. And then help to buy, we're going to take this one out because there's now 150 in there. So we can put 150 in two car, like that. Happy days. So that is that for that. I'll just pop those back there, I reckon. Cool, so that's that for that binder. That's all looking nice and tidy. Um, this five pounds I will leave there to remind me 
but it needs to go somewhere else a bit later on. So Oscar's binder is next. So first thing is Ostuff, and that's getting £10. I've just gab gabbled on a lot um, about other things, so I won't update you about this, but I will. <laughs> uh, so £30 now in Ostuff. So Clubs is getting £10 and I'm just going to take this tracker out because it's all wrong um, and it got messy. So £10 is going in for O stuff. So that's two fives, which is annoying. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 45, 50. So 150 in there should be what we need actually for his next lot of bills. School is getting £10 as well. Oh, oh yeah, okay. <laughs> I was about to moan about having to use fivers again, but we've got a 20. So there's 140 now in school, 100 in the bank, 40 in cash. We will swap that for another 100, which I've got off to the side. This is a slightly different colour to the other 100 because trying to get um, colours like consistent on vellum was quite difficult. Not consistent with the print, but consistent with the colour that I had on screen. Um, so I've got an awful lot of um, trying to grab them. Ah, I can't, them all fingers and thumbs. I've got an awful lot of like test ones <laughs> I wasn't sure about, um, which is good for me. I have loads, which is lush. Um, so there's 140 in school. Oh, that's better. Oh, I prefer that. I much prefer that. I love these, absolutely love them. But in terms of my shaky hands and trying to wrestle things in and out of envelopes, that's much better. So 140 in there. School holidays. So this is the April school holidays and we still have 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 10, 1, 13. So 50 of that is going for his football club, um, which means we've got loads left to do other things, which is lovely. So we're going to see my mum tomorrow. So we'll probably spend some money on some snacks on the train. And also we're going to go to the cinema. So me and Oscar absolutely love the Monsterverse movies, which is like the newest Godzilla and King Kong movies. And there's a new one out and I'm so excited. We wanted to go and see it um, opening weekend, but just life. Uh, so we're going to go see it this weekend. And I can't wait. I really, really can't wait. We saw a trailer for it when we went to, sit to the cinema the other week. Um, and we both just looked at each other like, oh my gosh, we actually get to see one of these in the cinema. Ah, so excited. Uh, right, so back to school. I'm on a gabble. Back to school is getting five pounds. So there is 20, 40, 55 in there. Lovely. So now we get to go to the yellow binder. Ah. Let's grab it in. Oh, before I do that, I'm going to put three pounds into our dear floss. Here she is just off camera. So one, two, three in there for her. And then the new binder. So I did transport over the beautiful key ring that Gillian sent me because it just is lush. And I don't know, I'm no good with colours and stuff really, but I just think that pink and that yellow just look cute together. So that's staying, but my dashboards have gone. Um, let's just check how you are in camera because I have a plan for this, you see. Let's move that over there a little bit. Pop that five to the side. That gives me some space. Yes, it does. Super. So first thing we're going to do is hair. And hair is getting £40, I think. Yeah, so 20 40 for hair, so we've got 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90. Um, I'm just going to swap some bits out. I'm feeling a bit nervous about notage. So yeah, uh, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90. So yeah, 190 in hair, which should be enough. Oh, that's awkward. Let's go that way, Jenny. That's better. And then the rest of the binder is all clear envelopes with um, trackers in that I'm going to colour, which is why I needed the space. So I figured it would make it a lot easier for me rather than trying to wrestle things out this way and blah, um, it would just be easier to do it this way. So what I've done is I've put together loads of real rough and ready um, clear envelopes. So if you miss my debt update, I broke the laminator that I normally make clear envelopes with. Um, so I had to make these in my other laminator, which is not really fit for the job. I mean, it's fine it's not anything I would ever sell because there's just imperfections everywhere it's impossible really to make a perfect uh, clear laminated envelope but I really don't like things that aren't less than perfect <laughs> which is my issue uh, right so laptop don't know why I took that out that's not getting anything um, but there is still 80 pounds in there so piggy saver this is for the May uh, half term we're gonna save 
£200 for that. So each of these piggies is £10 each. And this is getting £20 this week. Yeah, so I'm going to colour these piggies in green. I know piggies aren't green, uh, but Oscar's favourite colour is green. And this is all for him, after all. I might change my mind, actually. They look a bit odd. <laughs> I might colour those in pink. Uh, so 20 quid is going in there with that. Oh, I feel like Carrier Cash giving it a blow. Never done that before. <laughs> right, so 20 quid into there. It's going to take me a little while to get used to these envelopes, I think. Lovely. So next is birthday. That's my niece's birthday all done. And then this birthday is for myself, which is lush. So just five pounds going in there. Do we have a nicer one? Oh, they're all pretty minging. Let's do that one. So five pounds for me. I'm just going to colour this all just in pink this time, I think, because um, it was a wee bit of a faff trying to colour in all the three different colours. So fiver for me for my birthday. Oh, <laughs> I was hoping this was going to be easier, but I don't think it is. And then birthday, this is for Oscar, and that is getting 15. And again, we'll colour these in green. I might just do the bow and I'll just leave it like that. No, does that look weird? I don't know. I'll see how that looks on camera. I might change my mind in the future. So 15 quid for Oscar's birthday. And then we are into the beginning of Father's Day. And I think that's getting money this week. Yep, that's getting a fiver. So we'll colour in two of these beer jugs. Um, all of these black and white thingies are, um, trackers are in my shop if you're interested. Um, but there is five pounds for Father's Day in there now. Let me know what you think about this binder. Um, and if it is annoying, trying to watch me wrestle things in and out. So this one here is for Carolana. So let's rub off those three. Two ticks. There we go. And are we actually putting any money in here? Yeah, I could have left two of those. <laughs> Never mind. Right, so I'll colour that one in and stick in the fiver that we had from earlier and another five. Should we just use that grotty tenner? Oh, that's so gross. I don't want to know what's on there. Never mind. Right, so I'll pop £10 in there. And then Italy, so um, I put in a fiver again this week and we'll be on 7.40, so I need to leave a 10. So we've just got 10 pounds left now for being halfway on Italy, which is really exciting. And then the last thing in the binder is Saveopoly. So let's have a play, let's grab a dice. Again, my dice tray is under everything. So where were we? We were here last time, Dice Gardens. Two, one, two is go, and you get to keep some money when you pass go. So keep five pound for you as you pass go. Lovely. So what we'll do is we'll put that five pound straight into cheeky bonus, I reckon. And the other five we will put into freedom. Why not? Cool. Where's my rubby pen? Oh, there it is. There we go. So we are on go, and nothing's going in there this week, but that is fine. So yeah, I used the family budget um, for this, which is why um, I'm going to put it into Cheeky Bonus rather than putting it into any of my own personal envelopes. So there we go, like that. So that is the yellow binder. Aww. Let me know what you think. Honest feedback, really. Um, I would love it. So what do we have left? 20, 25, 35, 45, 50. Hmm, something is not right here. Oh yeah, because £15 is going back to the bank for what's a Mahoodie, isn't it? Yeah, £15 is going back to the bank for um, car. That's better. So we've got 20, 35. Yep, that's correct. Lovely. Okay, look. So we have got £9 for cheeky bonus. And I was how much was I going to put into Freedom. Yeah, Freedom's getting 30, but then it's got the extra five. So we're putting 35 into Freedom. So let's see where we are at. So 15, 25, 35. There you go. 10 and 25 is 35. Yeah, so 25. And... 
actually I'm really surprised that all worked out. I thought that was going to go horribly wrong. <laughs> so that's freedom done. So now we've got loads of fun for um, cheeky bonus. I will need to get my dice tray though. One sec. Oh, you will not believe the state. Well, you probably would believe the state <laughs> of my desk. Right. So cheeky bonus. <laughs> Let's do this. Let's put the dice tray over this side. Should I do nine rolls? Why not? Let's go for it. So four is debt. Oh, there's a fiver in there now. Lush. Two is Ben. And Ben again. That wasn't a very good roll, was it? But never mind. And again. <laughs> Ben's getting all the money. It's about time. Oh, six is gifts. Cool. Five is charity. So one out, two in. One is Oscar. Two left. Four is the debt. So two in, one out. And the last one, please be for me. Yay! Good out. Thank you very much. So one for me. So that was it for cheek bonus. Let's see where we're at. So Oscar has got two, four, six. Ben also has six. I have one. Debt has six. <laughs> Charity has 12, 13, 14, 15. And Gifts has one. And I am so going to have to condense these. Look, there's just too many coins. Um, so yeah, next time we come back, these will all be five pound notes, I expect. So yeah. Oh no, that is too chunky. Can't close it. <laughs> Never mind. Um, so that is it. That is the end of the video. And um, I feel like I did quite well, actually, word wise. Unless I watch this back and I find that I've used the wrong words in places the whole time. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think about the setup of the yellow binder. Is it annoying to watch? Does it work for you? Do you like it? Let me know. Um, and yeah, I hope you have an amazing week. So reminder of this week's amazing affirmation is I am enough and don't need to prove anything to anyone. I love it so much. Yay. Right, cool. Have an amazing week and I will see you next week for another cash dive in. Thanks so much, everyone. Bye. Bye.